Warning, this video isn't for anyone under the age of 16. If you're under 16 years old, please leave the video now because we do get into some adult type shit. Thank you. Hey, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Charles Anime World and welcome to my review of Redo Healer Episode 9. Now, what I like to do on my channel is I like to showcase off the differences between the anime and the manga without spoiling you guys because anybody can do a live reaction and anybody can do a review but I want to give you guys a reason to subscribe to me for future videos so let's talk about this episode of Redo Healer episode 9 now this episode takes place between chapters 20.1 and 20.2 so there was a lot of anime fluff within this episode of Redo Healer but we're going to talk about all of that okay so the first big difference is at the very beginning of the episode when they're sitting down eating. In the anime, they're eating soup, but in the manga, they're eating a piece of meat. So, again, I don't understand what it is with the anime and soup or stew or whatever, but now it seems like Kiaro and the gang, they always are sitting around a big pot of stew now. I, I, I don't know. Yeah, it looks good. It looks appetizing, but I don't know. I don't get it. Uh, the next difference is, in the manga, the anime completely skipped the part when Kiaru explains demons controlling monsters. Now, that was a part that happened in the manga. The anime decided not to showcase it at all. Um, I don't know why they didn't, but again, you know, it is what it is. You, I, I don't know, okay? Another big difference, and this is one that's really, really worrying me, and I'm going to explain to you guys why it's worrying me so much. In the anime, they explain the di divine bird, okay? And they explain him very, very early. And I'm going to tell you guys why I'm so concerned with this, because they're explaining him this early in the series, but in the manga, we just completed that little divine bird arc two weeks ago. Just two weeks ago, we just completed it. And the manga is much, you know, way ahead of the anime, but we just completed it two weeks ago, and they're explaining it now, which makes me worry about future episodes of Redo Healer because I hope that they're not going towards a rush end because they thought that maybe people wouldn't like the series, and they thought that they can fit it all in 13 episodes, and they're going to rush to an anime-only ending. I hope that's not the case because with the popularity that Redo Healer is getting now, I'm highly sure that it's going to get a second season. I mean, I really am, but I hope that the people that were creating this thought that, okay, this series isn't going to fly and make it cancel, cancel culture. You know how that shit goes. So they're going to try to wrap it up with the anime only endings. I hope that that's not the case. The anime, and I don't know why they did this. Actually, I do know why they did it because they had to add in the extra sex scene at the end. So I know why they did this, but... The anime completely skipped the cat girl assassin. Yes, Kiaro takes on a cat girl. Um, they have a fight. And Kiaro um, actually gets revenge afterwards. Because she attacked him. So he needed to get his revenge on her. Which is understandable. They completely cut that out of the anime. That never happened. It never occurred. Again, uh, yeah, I mean, that's one thing that I really want to see that the anime just took out for whatever reason, but it's in the manga, though. It's like two pages to two and a half. No, it's actually like three pages long in the manga, but again, you know, they cut it out of the uh, the anime, so whatever. Um, also, Setsuna was the only one with Kiaru during the investigation to the, the bull demons, um, but in the manga, everyone was there. So that was another difference as well, where the anime was just want to focus a little more on Setsuna, but in the manga, the whole group was there. Um, the next big difference is, in the manga, Eve actually gets her first taste of revenge on the bull demons, and this happens in the manga. The anime decided not to showcase that at all. You know, they, they didn't show it at all. Maybe they'll show it next week, but I highly doubt it. Because Kiaro left the Bull Demon, so I doubt that that's going to happen now. At the very end of this episode, we saw that Kiaro was happy to see Norm, you know, Freya's sister. You know, he's happy to see her. But in the manga, not so much. He wasn't really thrilled to see her. Um... And that's pretty much all the differences for this week's episode of Redo Healer. Um, everything else you saw was anime only, or it was a canon enough to the manga that I didn't really need to discuss it. Um, they added the sex scene at the very end with, with Eve, you know, when she was 
feeling on herself, which was really good. Really, really good. I enjoyed that. That was a nice little taste right there. I really enjoyed that. Um, And that's the episode for this week. But hey, that'll do it. Thank you guys so much. That's been my review this week for Redo Healer Episode 9 Uncensored. Um, Thank you guys so much. I will catch you next week. And hey, sign our suckers.